Welcome to the triumphant return of Chris and Ahmed. Look at pictures year of quarantine 2020 year of 2020. Mm -hmm. The worst year of my life terrible. to this point, right? It's been terrible. really bad. Yeah, it's, it's a very bad. year. It sucks. And now we can't even do Chris and Ahmed. Look at pictures with a weird sentence after it. We have to social distance. Yeah, we can't I touch. usually like to like smell you when we look at these things and <laughs> yeah. do that. Make you uncomfortable with my bad words and stuff. You have no idea what I smell like right now. <laughs> no, I don't. That sucks. Yeah, that's, that's OK. What is that cream sickle cream? and with a matching skin tone to go with it. But I'm still not used to it. No. Right? Seeing him in orange especially is like ultra shocking as compared to anything not New England. It's almost like he's confused in that picture, right? He's like, what am, what am I doing? <laughs> it's like he's a, he's a dog. He's a dog. He's like, I haven't played with the ball in so long. It's <laughs> <laughs> <Here's> a ball. <laughs> ball. Good to know that the hair still works in New England. Like Belichick has not put the kibosh on his hair. How does the helmet feel with all that hair in there? So we'll get yeah. an interview with him. That'll be the one question we ask him. How's That's your it. helmet feel? How's your helmet feel? I mean, the masked bandit from the Chargers coming That's into cool. town here and probably looking at it going, oh, shucks. Oh, gosh, damn, jolly G, George. Look at this <laughs> helmet. <laughs> Good to know that he's bonding uh, with Jordan Love as if they are playing youth football together and taking a, a, a orange slice break. I think this is Aaron Rodgers after a few days of practice realizing Jordan Love is like really raw. Yeah, might have some <laughs> talent at Rob. He's like, <laughs> he's like, woo, woo, I'm gonna be the quarterback here for a few years. Trubisky's like, I could have done that. I could have hand it. off. I could have done that, and I could have probably even done it a little bit better. I'm a lefty, and it looks weird to see a lefty quarterback. There's so few in football now. It's like, what the hell? Oh. Joe Burrow. This is straight out of Central Casting for a, uh, a quarterback from a, for a varsity high school football team. That's not a real football player, right? That's just like a Abercrombie and Fitch came out with their new football line and they just, they here's their guy. Holy cow, he got in the weight room this off season. Damn. Here's the question, does that change your fantasy ranking of where you would draft him in your fantasy draft? No, the arms are not gonna change my- what do you mean? If it you could. let me show me his like hamstrings and butt, maybe I'll change it, but So I mean, that's not gonna make him a better football player? No, but the, the arms for show. are not. It's the total arms. for show, it's total for show. That's all that is. So if you're a scout out there and you're scouting muscles, you scout legs, Yeah. you scout butt. Right. Arms, red flag. Well, yeah, arms are just like, it's like, Cream, you know, that's like just uh, icing on the cake. So a guy with the, out there with giant quads and a giant butt, but yet like noodle arms would be like, that guy, he's got something there. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen my ball? That's Keaton, a deep belly button. Keaton Look Southern. at that belly button. You could stick your whole finger in there and I think it's gonna disappear. <laughs> I didn't think we'd be talking about his belly button. <laughs> well, you never know. <laughs> okay, so the caption on this picture was, Julio Jones makes a catch in training camp. So according, really? to, according to the caption, he caught this ball. Do you believe that? No. I don't believe that. I don't believe that. Here's Justin Jefferson, uh, a rookie, and this has got rookie written all over it. He's like losing his chin, <laughs> losing his, his chin strap. There's no way he's making that catch. Yeah, that's a disaster. I think he caught that though. I do. Oh, you he, do think he caught it? I do. It. I think he's working on letting it go over his shoulder and oh, falling yeah. in the bread basket there, right that, right? So this is one human. This is not two separate humans. This is not a legs and a butt human and then a chest human. That's one human put together. That's pretty unbelievable flexibility right there. Fun. There is no more stressful job, and I'm gonna almost say, I'm gonna say in sports, than being a long snapper, I think. I think a harder job is being a quarterback or yeah. a shortstop in baseball, but I think for pressure, it's like you got one job. That's it. And if you mess up your job, that's a disaster. There's it, no you, reaction. You, you could lose the it. game. Yeah. Especially if you're punting like with a minute left and your team's up by three. And, and you it's just like, all you, all, yeah, all you got to do, yeah, the punter too. It's like being a long snapper, I don't think I could handle that pressure, to be honest with you. Yeah, no, you couldn't. You'd melt under it, totally. But I think most people couldn't handle it. No, just you. <laughs> most people could. I'm not digging the orange hair, though. You know, Vaughn, just so you know. I know you always wanted to be a longhorn, Vaughn. You always wanted to do that. You went to that other school, right? But, you know, you don't have to do your hair orange to be a longhorn. We yeah. can just call you. It's cool. Don't worry. That's it. We did it. Kristen on the look at pictures. Yeah. Thank God we didn't Good do that. Hi, I'm Mike Tirico, and thanks for watching. Make sure to hit subscribe for the latest news and highlights.
from NBC Sports.